what's up everybody, I'm Super Saiyan GV and welcome to Midnight Remastered on the PC. So yeah guys, this is another horror game I found online here. Um, I heard this one's kind of short, this one's probably going to be a little bit more short than some of the other ones I played, but uh, yeah, I found this one and uh, seen some good reviews on it and everything. It's uh, it's basically like, it's kind of like, um, what is it, it's a pixelated uh, horror game, kind of like an RPG style maker one like we did last time. But yeah, this one has a lot, you have to do a lot of like searching for certain items. You basically have to find like the seven deadly sins parts or something, something like that. I I forget out the top of my head. But uh, yeah, we're going to take on Midnight here, Midnight Remastered, sorry, this is the remastered version. So we're going to go ahead and get started the video. Make sure you hit that like button, it really helps out a lot. And comment, subscribe to my channel. Alright, so I have not played that much at all of this. I've only played a little bit of it. Let me just make sure. Yeah, okay, so I'm probably going to use Z or Spacebar to interact with stuff. So, I know you got to go around this big haunted house and find certain stuff you need to get in order to go. I don't know how good this game is. Like, I really don't know. I mean, I've seen good reviews on it, mostly at least. But, uh, yeah, if this is a remastered version, like, it's going to be a little bit better than the original. So, let's go ahead and start here. I think it just throws you right in, right? And I see the blood right there in that house. Because who doesn't see that? Play at night. Turn off the light. Wear headphones. Well, t two of those are correct, but it's not nighttime. Yes, the light's off, but I mean, it's already pretty sunny out, so I can only do two out of three of those things. Yeah, I can't do it at uh, midnight, unfortunately, because, uh, or late in the, in the evening, because I have to be somewhere today in the evening, so understand all right so first off i want to say the music is very unsettling so i cannot leave inside here okay so the music is kind of disturbing all right so write your full name on a piece of paper turn off all the lights knock on your main door 20 22 times open the door without the candles then relieve your candle you have now invited the midnight man clear his sins um are these our, our objectives? I still... Is that... Tails found a match. Okay. Okay. Alright. So that door is locked. Door is locked on the other side. Well, yeah, I noticed that. Nope. Not going that way either. There's a weird, uh... Mechanic here. Once you have to press it twice in order to do something. It is a little bit more zoomed in than I want it to be. But, oh well, dude. That's fine. Alright. Let's go up. I saw that. You ain't fooling me, game. Alright. But you have to press it twice in order to get that message to pop up and everything, dude. Alright. I have no idea what to expect right now, guys. The game said there are enemies around. Why do you gotta press that twice, though? It's just kind of weird how that works. There are enemies around that will try and kill you. But so far, we've seen... You know something bad about they have in this room. Honestly, like the pixelated graphics do look kind. Of... Okay, it's just thunder. Thunder. <laughs> I think it's just thunder at least. Just interacting with all the th trying. To... Oh. Hi there, blood. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in this room, so let's get on out of here now. It can run, thankfully. I know, right? A horror game where you can run? It's weird. Uh, I was kind of standing on top of the fridge there for a sec. I think I can interact with it there. A key card reader, oh boy. Anything else here? Nope, the door's locked. You can feel cold air coming from the inside. I have a feeling that's like a freezer. And kind of getting Mario in the music box vibes right now, but it's a little... The only thing that kind of sucks, like, I have seen gameplay of the original. You unlock the door. And the, the thing about the original was it was more zoomed out, which made it a little bit better, in my opinion. But, like, the atmosphere and the sound effects in this remake are much better. You found a match taken from in between the vents. A action use match. Action use match. Action use... Okay. That looks like you could hide a body. Alright, so far so good. What is this room? Am I going anywhere? This is a really long room. Hold up. Did we go down? 
He unlocked the door. Okay. Oh wait, we're back here. Um, hold up. Is this the door they were talking about? Okay, so you gotta cleanse your sins, basically, in order to do anything. Alright, so where are the monsters at, dude? Come on. Okay, my heart is... Her heartbeat's going a little bit, but not that badly anymore. Where are the monsters, dude? I mean, so far, it control... You know what? We're going in there. No. In there. This looks like the exact same room I was in before. Is it? Wasn't I here before? Hold up. Can't go that way. What is that? Am I outside on the... Ow. Oh, I'm at a staircase. In a library? Okay. Hey, there's not... I don't see, like, any monsters or anything. There's not, like... I could have sworn there'd be more enemies in this. Also, I still do not know what to do right now. <laughs> Picked up a match, okay. Well, I got the matches, but... What happens that I run out of matches? Also, where the... Pride? Picked up Letter of Sin. Okay. Is that... Uh... Is... What? What? I... I have no idea what just happened. Well... I fell, I guess? I guess I fell through the floor? Did I go in here? That's where I was earlier, wasn't it? I don't know. I forget. Dude, there's like a million rooms here. What is this? Broken TV. I can't really interact with that. Alright, you can't go past there. If you don't run, you move at like a snail's pace, dude. Alright, there's nothing in here. Alright, um... I gotta keep looking around here, dude. What's in here? Anything? Anything worthwhile? Plus, here's a letter of sin. Okay. So you got the seven deadly sins, or letters, okay. Uh, do I want to? Why not? The passage is too vertically steep to climb up. Action needs match, action needs match, action needs match, yeah. Okay, so does that just automatically happen whenever I, I don't have a match here? I need to move a little faster here too, dude. Just saying. I need to step up my game here. What's this? What is that? Oh, he picked up a key card. Okay. The only thing is I don't know how to get back there. How do I get back to the area I was at before? I don't remember. Um, through here? No, 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 that's not right. We were here earlier. I think you have to go back down here, right? Maybe? Maybe it's in here? I don't know, dude. There's, there's so many different ways to go here. It's tough to tell when you don't have a map here. That's yeah, definitely not it. Anything on here at all? Looks like a chalkboard or something. Where are the enemies, dude? Where's the horror? Come on, give me something. All I hear is sound effects, and there was like the little ghost that appeared there for half a second. You know what, music, you're not even gonna scare me, dude. You know what, we're gonna go. Something is against the door on the other side. I don't know why I gotta always press that twice. It's just kind of weird how it works. Alright, is this key card in here? Maybe? No, this is just that big, endless room. <laughs> it was in here, right? The frick? That's my last match, dude. Uh, he is the freezer key card. I have a bad feeling about this. Am I gonna get locked in here and die? Gluttony, okay. Picked up a letter of sin. I need more, uh... Matches here, dude. That's what I need. I 
I really need more matches here, dude. More matches, please. Pretty please, give me more matches. Oh, Envy, okay. Picked up another sin. Dude, where are the scares, though? Like, we need more scares here. Come on, game. You gotta give me more on this. You don't have to do it, okay. Like, you just need to give me something else here, you know? Wasn't I here before, too? Yeah, this is where I was earlier. There's a shortcut back here now. Um, I don't know where else to go here. Well, I kind of just going down random halls or something. Or is like, okay, this is where I was earlier. This is downstairs. It's like whole hallways work weirdly. This music is so creepy too. Like, you always have to press that twice in order to get anything done there. Alright, so... I can't go in there no matter what. Maybe that's like a last second thing I gotta do. <sighs> Dude, where'd I go? Here? Okay. This is the area I was in before. <laughs> Again. I keep going to the same areas over and over again. Oh! Okay. That actually scared me. Finally, I got a little bit of a scare there. That's what I needed. I think those guys catch you. Your match goes out. Can I... There's also a weird... There's a weird mechanic, like if you... No, we were in here earlier. Like, if you keep running towards the door, you could just... Is that it? Your sins will never be cleared. Hmm. Huh, that felt a little cheap of a death animation. Wow. Didn't even get all the way through. Yeah, I kind of don't feel like retrying this, guys. I'm sorry. Um, you know what? There's some. There was a another game I wanted to try here, so let's try that game. Why not? One of you. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, so this is one of you. This is uh. This is kind of like the game we played um last week. Where it's like a sto more story driven than anything else. My gosh, that music is loud. Turning it down now. Okay, so how to play? Or wait. All right, new game. Here we go. So yeah, this one's kind of like uh, the cabin one, where you have to like um, make good decisions on how to live and everything. So we got like this. You choose your character. Uh, Let's go, uh, scenario one. Zero keys on the key one press D. Okay, whatever. Dude. Okay, fine. You can laugh at me all you want. Ouch, it feels like I took a hit from a sledgehammer in the back of my head. This one's more story driven, but whatever. Where, where am I? Alright, so. Looks like a candle. Had something to light this candle. I would be able to see better. I mean, I'm sorry, I done nothing important. As usual, nothing important. That's what they always say in these games. Nothing important. You're nothing important. What do you, what do you think about that? It's too dark in here to see what this is. It is pretty dark to tell what that is, dude. Alright, let's check the TV. TV's not working, okay. I check this thing here. I might be able to read this if it wasn't so dark in here. What's this? Safe allows me to store power to the house, but I can't see what button to press. Alright, you found a lighter, okay. You can light that. It's the power button to restore power. What? Uh oh. Which one? Nothing happened. Okay, so it gives you more t multiple choices here. I had a feeling. Is it the yellow one? I had a feeling it was the yellow one, but I wanted to see what would happen if I chose some other ones. Okay, I just partially knew about that. Danger and inhabitable hazard. Looks like it has the acid chemical agent. The cancer is empty, okay. The TV's on now. TV's working. 
All right, rules of dis discipline, uh, description, I guess. If you live in my house and you'll be able to ab abide by my rules. Refusal to abide by my rules will result in infractions. I am ab absolved from the rules because I have been chosen as a rehabilitator of humanity. What the heck are you talking about, dude? Our infractions, infraction example, minor, backtalk, crime, cursing, filthiness, and all that. You know what, dude? Nothing cares. Stop like someone who is undergoing rehabilitation physical violence towards me. Okay. But we'll see you on the last one. Alright, minor infractions will result in a minimum of one day or more of isolation in the re rehabilitation room. The absence of food or water until the behavior is improved or deemed unacceptable. Okay. So, Alright, maybe death. Okay, death. I kind of figured that'd be. Alright, time to get on out of here now. Trying to store his lock too. Who the heck was that, dude? Who the heck was that? I think that was the other scenario, actually. Found a newspaper clipping. Uh, sick and twisted. All right, you guys can read that, cause a young teenager being hanged in what happens to be a dungeon or so has gone viral across all social media platforms. Video, which is very graphical, depicts an older woman, probably in her late fifties or sixties, rope. Uh, wrap a rope around a young teen's neck who was sitting on a chair and then proceeded to move the chair as the teen is left to hang the identity of the girl and man's unknown police are asking anyone who may have the information about the video to call their local police department immediately okay i know i just skipped skimmed through that real fast but whatever dude i did not mean to do that no 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 i wanted to see out the window there for a sec these bars around the well but i was finding another way to escape uh hello is anyone out there I'm trapped in here. Door won't open. Please uh oh. Yeah, this game depends on the good choices you make. I might be dead if I help, or I might just walk away. Ah. Uh, uh, what should I do, guys? Help or walk away? You know what? We're thugs. That's why I'm gonna get you out of here. That's how my door is bored. I cannot remove these boards with my bare hands. You have to help me. Please don't leave me in here. I'm going to look around his house and see if I can find some tools to remove these boards. I'll be right back. Okay, please hurry. Got this one. Door's locked. Okay. So you you guys are the other scenarios. Who are you? I don't know. Where am I? Where am I? We're not sure. Do you recognize this place? No, I've never seen here before. What's your name? I, I can't remember my name. Both of us will come to the same place. We can't remember anything either. I think we're all suffering from amnesia. I, I'm not doing that, guys. Where are you going? I'm leaving to go get help. We can't leave. What the hell? Who put the padlock on this door? I don't know. The artwork is pretty nice for this. I will give it that. Is this some sort of joke? Because I don't find this funny at all. I was just a joke where we're trapped in here until we can find that key to the door. You're telling me this is the only way to escape this cabin? As far as I know, I know every door in this house is locked except for the bathroom. There's gotta be some cool clue or something that's why we're trapped in here. Hmm. I almost forgot about the DVD. Now you we got power, we can see what's on the disc. Can you put the disc in a DVD player for me? I mean, I guess. Found a DVD. There's some scribble. Oh, the devil is among us. What about tools? Pizza! Forget that pizza! This food looks edible, even though it appears to be cold. Oh, yeah. Stockholm Syndrome. Oh, man. It has that definition of all things. I don't think we want to go anywhere else yet. We kind of look for tools. Door is locked. That's a door? Oh yeah, that is a door. Alright, let's do it. Television. Oh, I gotta press, put it in here. Yes. I mean, why wouldn't I? Oh my. What is this? Ooh. Oh. Oh my. I thought it was supposed to be a woman in a newspaper, not a dude. He, he killed that girl. What the heck did I just watch? Yeah, we gotta keep it friendly here because of YouTube. We got to get the heck out of here right now. I'm going to look around and see if I can find an escape route. Before you leave, is there anything else you can think of that, that might help us figure out what's going on here? Somebody's downstairs. Who's downstairs? I don't know who exactly, but I definitely heard someone in the basement. Come on, I'll show you. I will show you. Are hey, you still in here? Hello? Oh, he's gone. Are you sure you heard someone in there? Listen, I'm not crazy. I heard a voice. It was faint, but someone spoke to me. Hey, we're going to get you out of there. Just hold on. I hear Maya is playing tricks on you. There's no one in there. 
I know what I heard. I'm going back upstairs to see anything else on this a video. That voice, is she gone? Uh, why didn't she speak up? Dang it, why didn't she say anything? Now she thinks I'm a bit crazy because, <laughs> because <laughs> I think she is the one who put me in here. What, did you say she locked you in this room? Yes, I think it was her. Why would she do that? I remember waking up in this room and screaming for help, then she came to the door and told me to stay put. I mean, that could be a scenario. I don't know. I don't know why she did it. But I do know that she is not to be trusted. Well, maybe she has good reason to lock you up in this room. If that is the case, then why did she act so oblivious when you told her that somebody was trapped in this room? For some reason, everyone in this house is suffering from amnesia. That might be why she can't remember. She's hiding something. I just know it. What is she hiding? Answer me. What is she hiding? Yeah, I kind of figured. Talk to me! Silent treatment is starting to get on my nerves. I need to go back upstairs where I'm not going to get any answers down here. Okay. Can I go in here? I can. And I think I wanna. Well. Cinnamon rolls? Are those cinnamon rolls on here? I thought they were for a second. Like, this looks familiar. I can't remember what it's called. It's in. Uh. It looks like a weird refrigerator. What happened here? What's this paperwork? Hold up. Huh? Average high school class of 2002 reunion? Is that how old this game is? This looks familiar. Average high school reunion. I'm starting to remember. Oh! You're right, this is a very average high school. Man! <laughs> hey, this music too! We go from creepy to this? I like it! Person is busy dancing. Well, duh. Person busy dancing. This guy over here looks shady. Let's talk to him. <laughs> here, what kind of music do you want to listen to? Uh, let's see that one. Wait, it's not the exact same one. Hold on. This one? Huh? Ah, oh, okay. That just took a minute there. I seen the way you were looking at her. I was looking at her. Don't lie to me. I'm not lying. Oh, come on. Hey, don't tell anybody, but I spiked the punch bowl. Go, go, go get. Uh, yeah, whatever. I have a feeling I should talk to this person over here. What's going on, man? I haven't seen you in forever. How's it going? Okay. That's cool, man. Alright, this person is busy dancing. I'm assuming they're going to say that to them, too. Yep. Talk to this person here. Well, you are late as usual. How's it going, bro? Who cares? I'm here now. Calm down. I was just kidding. This guy, that's not him. Check out my new dance, Sh Sh Sean. Yeah, they call it the Weeble Wobble. What? Please stop dancing. Wait, isn't this the girl from. Are you ready to leave? Uh, no, not yet. You know when you're ready to leave. Oh, wait, they are them. I want to talk to this person first. Principal Walkers. Welcome to the reunion. Please be on your best behavior. Can you talk to the other person first? Oh, he's the same guy. His reunion is such a baddie. We should have gone to the bar instead. So, look like I do know these people. Yeah, so let's see. I'm starting to get let's head out to here. Okay. Very strange. Hugo, you don't look so good. Are you okay? Hugo! What the heck? Oh, I can move. Is he dead? Someone called 911. Poor Hugo. Are you guys ever going to grow up? Wait, don't leave just yet. What, what do you want me to do here? She looks so adorable, dude. <laughs> I need you to do me a favor for me, will you please? Uh, sure. What do you need? Can you stop by Dad's house and make sure he's okay? What's wrong? He asked me to stop by tonight after the reunion was over, but I'm not going to be able to make it because I had to stay here with Hugo. Did he say what he wanted? He said he brought a new computer and is having trouble setting it up. Come on, Sean. Yeah, you know I'm not as good with computers as you are. I guess it's his sister or something? Call him back and tell him that you will do it tomorrow. Maybe not? I don't know. I promised him I would come over tonight to fix that issue. Please do me a favor. I'll owe you big time. Moreover, you need to go visit him anyway. So when was the last time you seen him? Oh, well, I seen him. Maybe it was... Oh, I remember. No, that was somebody else. <laughs> See what I mean? Okay, you got me. I don't like going over to his house. You don't... You know that... You know that me and him don't get along. Sorry. Every time I go over to his house, he's always asking about you and why you don't visit him. Because he's an a-hole who used to beat on me. 
and mom. Oh, and do not let me forget about that rehabilitation room. You have to know what how long he's been used to living. In. Whatever, dude. I've been in that room for days with very little water or food. I forgive him for how long ago for our rough childhood. You have to move on with your life. No, please do this for me. I'm not going to kill you or to go spend some time with your father for once. He won't kill you. Sorry, I, I'm reading this so wrong. I'm trying to read this fast because I want to get to the hair, the scary stuff. Okay, okay, I'll go over. Thank you. One more thing before you go. Take this food with you too. You know how Dad loves pizza. Pizza. I see you later. Call me tonight. Let me know how he goes doing. I will buy. Pizza was the thing. I was in there. We all know each other. It explains how we all got here. I cannot remember the names of that man or the woman. What is our relationship to one another? And if this is my dad's house, and where is he? Good question. Um, anything else I can see? There's nothing inside here. Okay, nothing on the table. So we're going back now. So wait, we needed to talk to them, right? Yeah, we needed to talk to them. What's in that? Why did that man kill her? What? Oh, good question. So I don't need to talk to you guys then? Where's the lock? Oh, yeah. Guess we're going up here. More doors. Oh, this one's unlocked. It's a weird loading screen, too. Who are you staring back at? Okay. Somebody has, <laughs> somebody has terrible aim. There's nothing in here. It's some sort of brown slime on it. Anything else I could do here? What's this? Nope. It's a trash can. It's empty. Well, I kind of figured. Alright, I have a feeling one of these rooms has to hide something. Door's locked. I'm gonna try this room too. Door's locked. Probably up the stairs here. Sounds funny in here. There's something in that drawer too. I don't like this music either. I watched the acceptance. Oh man, really? What is this music? The box is empty. Fire hydrant or fire extinguishers, whatever. Alright, there's something at the top of the dresser, but I can't reach it. How do I get it down? Something inside these drawers. It's empty. Empty. It's a sticky wrapped around it. I wonder why. Oh, it's this chair. Use the chair. Here we go. We gotta use the chair. Let's grab it. Press C to grab the item. Yes, you found a key. Hey, we can get out of here now. No, well, maybe. I don't know. Well, let's get down there in one piece now. Hopefully. Uh, I don't like this. She's gone. Where'd she go? He's around here somewhere. Oh, I might as well get out of here. See you, suckers. Oh, wait. There's a padlock. I forgot about that. Yeah, you still need a hammer, though, for that. Actually, it's probably this room over here. Right? Key I found doesn't work on this door. Alright, so it's a different lock here. Is it this one? You unlock the door. Okay, so it is that one. Uh, I don't want to know. From every gas corp, your shipment of four gas con consistors should arrive in June tomorrow. Well then! Found he found a hammer! He's dead. Dad? I know what happened to you. You got what you deserved. What? Oh, I mean, the gas mask. I mean, he said he was a bad guy, yes, but wow. Husband here was not working on the moment. Wow, that's just starting to find a death note. I think this is it for me. I've finally, it's been fatally wounded, and I don't think I'm going to make it. I've already taken drastic measures to prevent anyone from coming in or leaving this house. I locked the front door and cut out all the escape routes. To prevent my pet from escaping, it's not ready to go back outside. It must remain here until the rehabilitation process is over. I don't have much information about the creature, but I will tell you what I know. The entity looks like a normal human being, but it's not a human being. It's something else, something dangerous. Oh my god, his ability to shape shift take on the appearance of any human being. So this is like a skinwalker. I need to come into contact with that person first. Nothing can stop it. It's a gas compound that immobilizes for a short duration. More information about this creature, please refer to the journal entries on the laptop in the basement. Remember, the creature somehow escapes. Do not trust anybody because it can be any one of you. Good luck, and may God have mercy on you. So, oh my gosh. Is it that dude, Printer, or is it that chick? Or it could be the other dude. I mean, like, first dude I was talking about was. Fit We're just jumping into 15 years ago already? You want to act like an animal? I'll treat you like an animal. Oh man, dude. 
So that's your dad. Please don't leave me in here. Let me in. I thank dad. Fifteen years later. What? Hmm. I will give it credit. The pixel art is very good in this game. There was unlocks I let myself in. Old man, where are you? So is this like... This is back then. I'm just gonna set your food on this table. Oh man, are you down here? Does that mean the girl is a bad person? I don't, can't see anything down here. Where are you? Help me, help. Sounds like the old man. Oh, he was talking. It's a TV, evil laugh. You now it's from a movie playing on the television. Yeah. I wouldn't say that. Wow, my dad. <laughs> I mean, it's just a flashback, but Dad, why am I tied up? What the heck is going on here? Who is she? Anna Toll, calm down, son. Everything's going to be okay. Daddy's here. I'm not going to let you anything happen to you as long as you cooperate. Now sit back and enjoy the show. What show? What are you talking about? Watch this. You see that? Remarkable, isn't it? What the? Did that just happen? I, I, I can't, can't! You're insane. I can't believe you just shot her like that. I'm insane? No, no, no. I shot this creature point blank in the head and it's still alive. This is insane. Untie me right now. I don't want any part of this. You disappointed me, son. I thought you of all people would understand the magnitude of this discovery. Go to heck, you sick fat bee man. I don't know. I can't. I, I, want, I don't want to... I just want YouTube to know I'm not a bad person. Your behavior is unnerving. It t needs guidance and correction. I think you need to be rehabilitated again. Don't do this, please. Just let me go. The rules must be followed. You can't do this. My wife is in the car waiting on me. What do you think she's going to do if I can't make you back to, to the car? Wait. Oh, yeah. It's 15 years later. Yeah, that's right. She's either going to come in here looking for me or call the police. Is that what you want? I will take care of her as well. Please. Before I are, I'll make you a believer. Please, what? What are you talking about? Help me! Help! Somebody help! I will untie you later. Come find me when you awake from your slumber. Is that... This is a different room. Hey you, untie me please! I don't know what my dad has gone and done or what he just happened right now, but I, I can help you. I just can get some help, but please untie me. Time to go to sleep. Huh? So that's the person in that room, I bet. And there's the gas, like in the first room. Present day. Hey, did you find anything in there? Yes, I did, but where did that woman go? She's upstairs, so what did you find? That man on the tape is in the room beside me, and he's dead. Well, he's dead, but how? I'm not sure what happened to him, but I found an escape route. Where? In the video we watched, there was a window without any bars on it. That's our ticket out of here. That room in the video is the same room that is boarded up downstairs. Oh my god, that's where the creature's gonna be. Or she is a creature, I don't know. How do you know all this? Or it's him, I don't know. I'll explain that out as soon as I know as we leave. We need to find that woman and meet me downstairs. Okay. Pretty good game, actually. Maybe I'll come back to this. You need to go upstairs. You need to go... What? You need to go downstairs. Why can't you go upstairs first? Because he went upstairs and I don't trust any of this crap. Wait, what happens if I... Let's see. Yeah. That'll work. We got a hammer too, dude. Are we gonna do this for real? Uh, I don't want to, but we're going to do it. Here we go. Where's that person I heard earlier? There's a staircase there. I remember that, dude. This is on camera, too. What's this? Day one? I found a girl in the woods not too far from my house. She was almost fair like and became combative when I approached her. I couldn't leave her like that alone, so I brought her back to my cabin. And let me tell you, it wasn't easy getting her back here. Even though we can say the girl was freakishly strong, I locked her in the basement downstairs because you can never be too careful around strangers. I will call the police tomorrow. Yeah, sure, dude. But dude, there's so many days here. Let's just get to day 30s in two weeks, though. 
water boot, and this creature is still living and breathing. How can that be? I'm somewhat relieved, but at the same time, I'm scared. Where is she? Is she immortal? So this girl is the creature, I guess? This is a minor setback, but she's not off the hook by any means. Rules must be followed. There is no way she will survive that store for her next... Right, I'll just show some of these off for you guys, just so you know. Uh, okay. Just kind of flim skipping, skimming through those. Um, let's say a dead rabbit. And your organs have been ripped out. Oh man, dude. Eee, come on, let's get out of here. We can escape through this window. We can't leave without the other guy. What are you doing down here? Damn, where the heck is he? I told him to find you and meet me downstairs. Yeah, you know this is a trap. We can't leave without him. Ah, <sighs> oh, man, dude, the decisions, the decisions. Like, first of all, we can't trust anybody, really. Second of all, like, even if we were to try to escape, I just... I have a bad feeling about that. I Like, I don't know, it's just, in my mind, I'm thinking if we try to escape now... We're gonna something bad will happen and we won't be able to escape. So we're gonna be thug and search for him. Okay, but as soon as we find him, we're leaving. Okay, follow me. Set me free. Trust me, and we will escape from the city. Danger. All right. Looks like toxic gas. Well, yeah, we saw that in the little vision there. Hmm. What's wrong? There's a man right, right, right here. Where'd he go? Also, that hammer in this room. It's missing too. It's probably that creature or thing. What are you talking about? I'll explain everything as soon as we find him and we get out of here. Let's go. So wait. Which one's which? Because you know it's gonna, it can take on the form of anybody, just like the skinwalker. What the heck? Who, who did this to him? The creature did this. We have to leave right now. How can you be so heartless? This man is dead and you sound so emotionless. It's in time to agree of Maria. He's dead. There's nothing more that we can do to help him. Let's go unless you want to be out of him. Why did you call me? Why did you call me Maria? That's your name. Maria, but how did you? Anyway, he's been coming back to me slowly in bits and pieces. What is his name and your name? How did you get, we get stuck in here? His name is Taylor. He's your brother. My name is Fred. I'm your husband. What? Really? What? And that man in the video we've seen, he's my father. But... Who is that crying? It's that creature. We got to leave right now while it's occupied. This is our only chance. Just give me a sec, okay? Okay, yeah, but make it clear, please don't dawdle. What? Where are you going? Uh. This car sounds like it wants to cut off. Where the heck is she? You should have taken her with her. With you. There's no way as her. I'm sorry, I don't buy it. What took you so long? I had to grab this before I left. Are you freaking kidding me? You kept me waiting for a stupid picture? It's the only picture I have of him. I'm sorry, Mary, I'll deal with go through tonight. It's been weighed heavily on my sight. He just wanted to go home, forget it's that never happened. I still cannot believe my father did that. I was right about him from the start. I tried to tell Shania the guy was insane. I'm sorry about your brother. This is all my fault. I should have never brought you guys here. I'm sorry, Maria. Maria? Maria, are you listening to me? Oh, man. Maria, would you put that picture down for a sec? I need to tell you what my father was doing. That's over Maria's shoulders. Let me see that picture. Wait a second. Why do you have a picture of my dad? Oh, that's a creature. Maria? What are you doing with that hammer? No, Maria! You and your friends broke the rules. So you must be punished. This is my father's will. You're not Maria. Yeah. That figures. So, that was a bad ending. Say what now? What are you doing out here by yourself like this? Easy now, I'm going to get her. I'm not going to hurt you. When the police finally entered the cabin, they found three decomposing bodies and the bodies that they had been eaten. Another body was found outside in the car. The body was probably disgusting. Oh my gosh, dude. One of the worst crimes he had ever seen. So this is one of the bad endings here, unfortunately. The girl on the DVD was never found. That was the creature, wasn't it? Alright, so that's one of the bad endings, I guess. There's a lot of different scenarios and endings for this game, but you know what? I think that's enough for today. I've had enough, so guys, both these games today have been 
pretty decent. I mean, I, I think I like this one better than the first one, but you know what? It wasn't that bad. They were both pretty fun to play through, and I enjoyed them. They weren't really like normal horror games. They're kind of like a psychological crossing. I'd say it's a 10, okay? I see how it is. Yeah, one of you, that's right. Yeah, all right, guys. We're going to end things up here for now. Shut up, you scream. Please just shut up. Please, shut up. Nobody cares. Well, kind of, I guess. But yeah, guys, we're going to go ahead and end things off here for now. So thanks for watching. If you hit the like button and comment, subscribe to my channel. Make sure to leave a like, guys, for uh, more horror-themed videos here. I'm enjoying making them, so you can just keep smashing the like button. All right, thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye, guys.